Hi, I'm Salma Zadora, sex and love expert, and welcome to week three of Have Sex With Yourself Month. So this week we're gonna talk about different kinds of orgasms for women, because really, men are always guaranteed an orgasm. Right, ladies? <laughs> so we're the ones who usually have to actually put a little work in um, to find all the ways that we as women can have amazing orgasms. And the good news is women are much more orgasmic than men. So women can have multiple orgasms uh, in one sexual session. So I want you to be able to learn how to let go and find and explore all these different kinds of orgasms for yourself. So a clitoral orgasm is the easiest orgasm for most women to have. And that's because you have so many nerve endings in the clitoris. And your clitoris is sort of like the light switch. When I walk in a room and I want the lights to go on, easiest thing to do, hit the light switch. So hit the clit. <laughs> and learning what feels good to you. Also using good lubricant. One of the things with the clitoris, I like to use coconut oil. Coconut oil and then really finding what kind of stroke, fast or slow, is most arousing to you and kind of teasing yourself. Because the clitoris is aroused so quickly, you can maybe um, have an orgasm from the clitoris too fast when you could drag it out and learn how to enjoy it more. And for women who've used vibrators on their clitoris a lot, sometimes they have a hard time feeling any other kind of orgasm. So then we're gonna get into the um, inner orgasm. So inner vaginal orgasm, G-spot orgasm. This is also where sometimes women are able to ejaculate or squirt. And I want you to remember this isn't about, you know, how good you are or if you've only had a clitoral orgasm, anything's wrong. Um, it's really about learning how to expand your sexual literacy and to go on this journey of exploring your own body. Everything that feels good is good but we just want to be able to expand that to feel more. So if you've only had clitoral orgasms, one of the good ways to start to have internal orgasms is working with a sex toy or a dildo um, or with a partner. So if you have a partner who wants to help you practice, and I mean, who wouldn't? <laughs> any any, any uh, man or woman who wants to partner with you on this is going to benefit from how much pleasure you have. So when you have internal penetration, then you can also add the stimulation of the clitoris. So if that's what's easy for you, having a clitoral orgasm, don't lose that part or think there's anything wrong with the clitoral orgasm. Just take the clitoral orgasm and combine it with the internal orgasm or the G-spot. And the G-spot shouldn't be such a mystery. The G-spot is inside your vagina and you would put your fingers inside, make a little C-shape and stimulate inside the vagina right up against the pubic bone. So it's a little like spongy area and you'll find that it's very sensitive. And the more that you kind of stimulate or tickle it, the more you're gonna to start to feel um, a greater sense of arousal, but some women stop at that point because they, they think maybe they have to pee. But that's really going to be that um, ejaculation that women are capable of. So you can kind of play around with finding your G-spot and once you find that, Try and stimulate it for maybe five minutes, 10 minutes, and then stimulate the clitoris and going kind of back and forth, teasing yourself. And tease the clitoral orgasm if that's what's easy for you. Kind of drag that out instead of having that fast clitoral orgasm. Drag it out as you create the, um, the internal penetration and the deep spot stimulation. So you're kind of using the clitoris as, um, as, as, as the trigger to help you feel more inside for the penetration and for the G-spot. So hopefully that's gonna help you explore these different kinds of orgasms. And remember, it's really about the journey of your exploration of your sexuality and of what feels good to you. There's no right, there's no wrong, um, but really learning to give yourself permission to try new things, to let go, and to have fun.